Easy. I'm locked, man. I ain't, like I, damn, y'all ain't even get to see the 15 minutes of fame interview. Wait till that drop, me and Twerk. Like, I'ma let y'all get a little sneak peek, though. Like, like I said, Twerk is the first nigga that, when Beasley called my phone and told me that's who I'm battling, that's the first nigga that I started writing for before I got a contract, a check, anything. Because I don't start writing until I get my money. Like, as soon as the contract come through, all right, I'm chilling. As soon as I get the deposit, bam, there's my motivation. Twerk. As soon as I heard his name, I started thinking of shit, pinning it. So, it's up. Like, I just know to not. I don't play with nobody, but I know I got to go to another world for him. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got to go to another world for bro. I have to because I, of what I believe he can do. You know what I mean? It's up. And that's just me being honest. Like, the nigga is too dangerous for me to... Like, uh... So, yeah, yeah nigga, you smoke, so... I, I'm gonna smoke you. Nah. I come in there like that, it's up and it's stuck. I fuck around, get 30, and he take my... Take, take the spot that I've been wanting to give to him. You get what I'm saying? So... In a parallel universe... I choke, and he wins. All three rounds. I choked in two rounds in a parallel universe. But this universe ain't parallel. <laughs> Facts, Tom Tom. Hey, Reezy, chill. I know what I'm doing. Nah, in a in a real universe? Y'all supposed to get the craziest battle y'all ever seen. I ain't gonna hold you. Make him rap. Y'all in a in a real universe, y'all supposed to get the craziest battle y'all ever seen. I ain't gonna hold you. That boy is one of them. Like, so. We'll talk about it. Work. I'm leaving this battle in your hands, bro. It's up to you how this shit go. You feel me? For real, for real. It's really up to you. Not there, you feel me? Like, it's really up to him. I'm gonna make sure I come with three fire ass rounds, and it's up to you to decide which ones you wanna win. It's up to you. Let's get it. Legend is definitely gonna be the one. We're gonna see. Listen, there's no way in 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 my mind. Like that's and, and this is why I'm preparing like this, bro. In my mind, there's no way in hell this nigga ain't coming with three rounds in front of Drake. He ain't he ain't doing that. But if you do, worst mistake, nigga. And I'm gonna be disappointed. Cause I love you to death. And I told you I wanna make a movie. So let's do this. Let's fucking do this. Like, I don't, I ain't got, there ain't nothing bad that I even have to say about this nigga. He ain't trash. I'll, I'm just ready for the smoke. Like, I know what I'm about to get into. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got, I ain't got nothing bad to say to him, about him in, outside of battle rap. I know outside of battle rap in, in real life, the nigga flip shit over for me. You feel me? Like. The nigga flipped a whole building over for me. You feel me? So it ain't it ain't nothing to trip about. We just gonna really get in here and get fucking crazy. Me and Twerk is I ain't I ain't got I don't care if he got any personals. I don't got I'm not getting there's nothing personal I have to say to this nigga. I'm not 
trying to dig into this nigga's personal life. I ain't got nothing personal to say. I'm about to come and get crazy with this nigga. Y'all know how I play. Y'all know how I play. I don't, I don't think I would. Y'all you, you, you see the, the chiller shit? I'm trying to come like that times a thousand. You feel me? Like times a thousand, nigga. I don't feel like, I don't feel like my chiller performance can beat twerk. I need to step it up. You feel me? So it's up. It's up. That was light on Chilla too. That was light. I ain't gonna hold you. That was light. Nah, nah. Well, I mean, that's my opinion, gang. I'm just, you know what I mean? I'm just speaking from how I feel. I got I got performances that beat twerk. But my Chilla one, my last performance, that don't, that don't beat twerk. I need to step it up. I'm battling myself. Better than my son. Watch this one. I wasn't. I wasn't. Daylight didn't scare me. Twerk did. It's bumps. Like. Nah. So what's up? Like, I'm. I'm not. I'm not battling on. Oh, I'm I'm that nigga. This is my house, and nigga, I'm battling out of fear, boy. You better really be on your shit, cause I know what the fuck you can do. And if you come in like that, that's all I'm worried about. I don't I don't care about you choking. I care about you being great. So that's what I'm worried about. You feel me? That's the only way I can explain it. Like. I, I'm only worried about you being dangerous. I don't give a fuck about you slipping up. I don't care about your slip ups. I ain't them other niggas, Twerk. I don't care about your slip ups. Because I know what you can do. For real. Yeah, Yo, bro, three rounds of playing with words. You couldn't have said it any better. And I ain't gonna hold you. That boy play with them words. Can't lie. That boy play with them words. Tuberculosis. Now cough it up. What? Like he be playing with some words. He be playing with some words, bro. That nigga's that nigga's been my favorite since he came out. I don't care about his losses. He's one of, he is one of the most creative niggas. You get what I'm saying? A lot of niggas, he changed the game a long time ago when niggas is still doing, trying to be who he is. But me and him gonna have a big talk about that. You know what I'm saying? You gotta think like, before there was a twerk, that was a Tay Rock. You know what I'm saying? Like the, the nigga that was explosive on stage and niggas was scared to battle. That was Tay Rock. Then it was Twerk. I didn't envision nobody like that but him. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's been a long time. Don't get me wrong, it's been others like him. No, 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 no. Chess been that. Chess was that at 15. When I seen Chess, Chess is 21 now. We talking right now. When Chess was 15 years old, he was terrifying. He terrified me. You get what I'm saying? Like, terrifying. Nigga, like, that's, that's twerk right now. You get what I'm saying? There's a lot of niggas that I've seen that I just knew I had to get into it with, but I wasn't. I was always ready. Like, you get what I'm saying? Like, I know I'm going to have to see him. It wasn't terrifying. But watching some of these niggas, it's terrifying. I'm like, hold up. Nah, when I see him, it's going to be something ill. Chest only nigga. 
Chess. The Chess is originally the first nigga that ever gave me that. Yo, I'm terrified feeling. You get what I'm saying? Like, he's the first person that ever did that. Twerk is the second. You get what I'm saying? Like, nah, nah. None of these niggas ever had me like, oh, I don't know what I can do with this nigga type shit. Chess was the only one. You know what I'm saying? Like, n none of them. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. Now, it was people that I started... It was people that I accepted battles with that didn't terrify me. But when I got locked in for the battle, I didn't know how to write for him. I was like, how am I even going to write for this motherfucker? Like, when I got Sharon. Like, I'm like, I, I wasn't... Sharon, he doesn't terrify me. I'm like, bro, I'm going to whip this white boy ass when I get on stage. Then I started writing, and I'm like, what the fuck am I going to say to Sharon? <laughs> like... I, it's glue easy did you not see how i did him I, I was super prepared for him since since the day the weed came out my hand i had it in for him so that was nothing but uh pat state disaster like when i got them names i didn't even in my mind i'm like i will smoke them niggas and then as soon as i got the writing for this it, like hold up i don't even know how to come at them i don't I, I don't know how to come at them because i ain't been around them you get what I'm saying? All these other people that I'm, I'm battling, I've actually been around in person. You feel me? Like, these niggas, I don't even know. So that, that shit was kind of crazy. Sharon is, too, Sharon is too different. Sharon is too different. Big respect. That boy got the heart of a lion. You hear me? Sharon. <laughs> that boy got the heart of a lion. He come to every event by himself. By himself from Canada. No friends. When he when I first seen Sharon in person, he battled shotgun Shug, my nigga. I don't know if y'all remember that battle. I don't know if y'all remember that. But yo, when I seen that, I'm like, yo, I gotta battle this white boy, yo. Like, nah, he ain't just do Shug like he ain't do my nigga Shug like that. I got I gotta get at this nigga. Real. But I ain't gonna stunt. Yo, Pat State and Shug, that was actually a great back back and forth. Shug was in his bag against Pat State. Even because you know Pat State is a dangerous motherfucker. Shug was in his bag for Pat, though. Like, if you want to say Pat won, I wouldn't be mad. But Shug ain't get body. I wouldn't even be mad if a nigga said Shug won. Nah, the fact that Pat was in the flower suit and he just said, yo, you ain't say nothing about... Da, da, da. Like, oh, man, he was... Pat was in his... Pat, Pat, he's a different type of animal, yeah.